Hi, I'm Mitch Mitchell, and today I'm doing a review. And whereas other people will review video games or maybe cartoons or movies, today I'm reviewing <laughs> socks. <laughs> this is the goofiest thing, but you know what? I'm reviewing socks. These things are actually called heat lockers. And yes, you know, you have to open up the thing. And I saw these at BJ's Wholesale. Um, matter of fact, I was with my mother yesterday in the Rochester area, and we went to BJ's because it's one of the trips that we make. And I saw these socks. And I said, okay, that looks interesting. And the only thing that I thought it looked interesting, because it talks about how it warms your feet up to seven times better than any regular thermal socks. And I said at the time, well, okay, you know what? I need to go check those out. I need to research that when I get home because if it had some kind of stuff in it where it generated heat, then I had to kind of think about staying away because I did this video, I think a couple years ago, where I talked about buying the heat packs and going to a hockey game and putting those things in my shoes and how they pretty much like burned my feet and my feet were really tender for up to three weeks and I'm diabetic so you know you don't go around messing with feet so I came back and I looked these things up and it said that it was made of these different types of polymers that's my wife's sound on the phone because <laughs> she's just that cool I'm just saying it anyway so it says up to seven times look at this there you go there's the seven times warmer so I wanted to give them a try. Now, they come in a two-pack like this, and they don't, it's hard to find two of the exact same color. So I'm wearing the black right now, and this is a dark gray. There was a really light gray, and I said, when the, am I going to ever wear a light gray? There was one that had a blue and a gray, and I didn't see, you know, like brown and gray, but it was like two different colors of blues, and I said, you know, what, what's the deal with that? So their intention, obviously, isn't that you wear these as normal, everyday socks. Whatever. So they talked about it. They talked about how it's woven. They talked about how it has this nice little cushion and how they would be really comfortable. But it's supposed to do this thing for seven times the feet. I'm one of those people who gets really cold feet. And when my feet are cold, the rest of me is miserable. Actually, it's my feet and my hands. And I can deal with cold. I mean, I've lived in some of the coldest places in the world. Okay, that may be stretching it a bit. I lived in Limestone, Maine, where the temperatures were regularly minus 25. And I live in Syracuse, New York, where it can get really cold. And, of course, we have the snow and all this other kind of stuff. And I don't go to a lot of hockey games because my feet always get really cold. So I figured, okay, let's give these suckers a shot. So I'm wearing a pair right now, and I've been wearing this pair for about an hour or so. And I wanted to talk about it. So let me say this. There's no instructions on how you're maybe supposed to wear these and then you know they're socks and I put that out because I gotta tell you right now my feet are not seven times warmer <laughs> these aren't warmer than anything they are really comfortable though you, you put your feet in them and it just feels like a pillow is just absorbing them so um, I usually buy diabetic socks not because I'm diabetic but because they're really comfortable they just are. They don't fit your feet really tight and they're a little cushier than normal socks. So I buy the diabetic socks. They cost a little bit more, but you know, there you go. So that's why I went ahead and decided, you know, I'll try these because these are $15 for two uh, pairs of socks. But I figured, you know, if they actually work, then it's worth a shot. So like I said, my feet are still cold. They're not any warmer. I'm thinking if they keep your feet seven times warmer than those other socks must really stink because I'm not seven times warmer. Um, I, like I said, there's no instructions, so it doesn't say anything that, you know, if your feet are already cold, then they're going to stay cold. It doesn't say anything like that. It doesn't say, well, we'll warm them up. It just says that we'll keep them warmer. Matter of fact, here's the thing right on here. It talks about the three-stage warmth process. So it talks about heat locker yarn. Uh, heat locker loops, heat locker inner. Okay, so my quick review these things aren't seven times warmer than nothing. Now, I don't have shoes on, I don't know if shoes will make them warmer, but I'm in my house. You know what? I work from home most of the time, so I don't wear shoes all the time in the house. So you know, if there's that caveat, they don't tell you that. 
So maybe at some point later on, I'll have my shoes on. Like I said, they're thicker, which means the shoes are going to be thicker. I'm not sure how comfortable that's going to be. I'll figure that out later on. But if I had to just you know tell you right off the bat, seven times warmer, uh-uh. Warmer than normal, regular old socks, a little bit. Uh, seven times warmer than thermal socks, uh-uh. No, ain't going to get there. Uh, very, very comfortable, though. So maybe if you're wearing boots and you need that little extra boost and you look for something a little bit more comfortable than those thermal socks and you don't mind spending 15 bucks for two pairs of socks, then go for it. But anything else, you know what? It doesn't live up to the hype. So there you go. I don't know if anyone else has done a review on heat locker socks. If not, you've just... Okay, I was about to say you've just been filled in, but then someone's going to say you're trying to steal from Philip DeFranco. Okay, it's a great line. You've just been filled in. I'm not Phil. I'm Mitch Mitchell. Y'all take care. <laughs>